What's up, y'all? We over here in uh, Channel View. Uh, y'all know what, what's up with that. Heading to uh, Issues. I think we're a little bit behind schedule. I was hoping to have the car back already. Uh, but man, I got the uh, app and some paint for the dash. Uh, so we're going to drop this off over there at Issues and see how uh, the update on the box gets. All right, this is the app we went with. Ish said it was a uh, budget friendly and pretty decent. We're going to test it out. And then that box from Summit just got the paint and primer for the dash. All right, he getting the grill mesh ready. It came a different color, so he had to spray it down. Yeah, yeah. See, that's it. that's the same thing happened with the carpet. And it's burgundy. That's the color I got. It, it's burgundy on the paperwork, so. But nah, this looks good right here. But this is better. Feel like starchy Archie, like the six. <laughs> <laughs> Got the armrest going. Oh shoot. He over here body working the uh, door panels. Keep game. Original ones were pretty much fucked up. We he made them a little bigger too. Throw a speaker in there later. But hell yeah, definitely getting there. Hell yeah, a little extra detail. And then you already, on the straps? Remember the straps? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Straps, yeah. yeah. Bad. That's where we got the strap, that way you can pull on it. It ain't gonna look like OG OG, but Similar to the original. It's over here playing build a block. <laughs> yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Nah, fuck it. I like it. Fuck with it, hell yeah. But the dash, then the app. Oh yeah. Been working though. Yes sir. Hell yeah. Aight. Yes, he mocking up the dash. He got a lot of work. He said by Friday he gonna be done. That gives us a week, so we'll be back later on this week. I gotta bring the seats and the other carpet. But it's definitely getting down. Ooh, look what we stumbled upon. A real low mileage. This ain't a barn, but you could call it kind of like a barn find. How long have you been in here for? Shit, about to look at the tag. Since 04? And before that. How much, how many, what's the mileage on it you said? 10,000. Oh, open that door. 10,000 mile lag. Oh. Man, still got the leather. See the mileage? 10 or 11, what is it? 10, yeah. 10,000 miles, man. Been parked here. Ooh, the top is perfect. It like just need to be ladder. Still got the. Oh yeah, it got like the metallics in it. Yeah. See, you got this shit repainted. Nah, you, and you can tell the chrome's good. It's just full of dust. Yeah. Nah, you watch this car fool. See, people thought it was blue because it kind of do look blue, but it got a little gray. blue, but it's huge. Yeah. And he still got his uh, Cadillac caps. I mean, he did some bows on this thing. Oh, it got the See? classics. Damn, nah, you need to talk to your uncle. Nah, for real. You really need to teach your uncle about getting it going. But nah, it's still good. That's low mileage. I mean, under the top, let me pop the hood. Look at the hood. Yeah, you know, it's still good. 
Oh yeah, it's it's just dusty. Dusty as hell. Yeah, that's that shit is brand new. Nah, it's still in good condition, fool. Yeah, yeah, I need to talk to y'all uncle. Get this girl going. Getting back on the road. Oh yeah, this will get back on the road quick. Yeah. The only thing you need to replace is they also got this man mint Lexus too. This got low mileage too or what? Shit, it's probably got it. But look at the wheels, man. These are like some three piece Lexus wheels or some or. Maybe some aftermarket, but they put Lexus caps, huh? I think he got it straight off the dip because when he brought it home straight off the dip, he brought it Oh, it was probably the option. Yeah, it was probably optioned out at the dealer. Man, I like the wheels on this Lexus. And this is Lexus a clean up too. Yeah. Big body Lexus with the gold package. Roof in it. Oh, yeah, that's nice. But I really like the wheels. What y'all think about the wheels, y'all? No buttons. Those are real buttons. Yep. Next day here at the shop, fellas. Actually had time to mess with this. Yesterday I didn't have my camera with me. Uh, threw that fan on there, started plumbing everything. Man, I ain't gonna lie to you. We was painting everything nice and neat before putting everything on. But at this point, I'm kind of, I'm over being frustrated. I ain't frustrated, but it just need to get it running. I threw the power steering hoses on there. Uh, didn't even clean them up. I really just want to crank this motor up and have it movable. Because I got it on top of my trailer. And that's no good. You know, it's always I'll, it's always bad to say we'll go back and clean that up because most of the time it doesn't happen. But uh, got my thermostat in. So my gauge on the inside started plumbing the, the fuel line. Today we're going to throw the starter on there, throw a battery on there. Uh, I'm not sure if the distributor's in there, stabbed in there just right. I didn't stab it in. I might try it like that or retake it out and make sure it's, 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 it's stabbed in right. I ain't the best at it, but, uh, or might swing it and just throw it on there like that. Mess some shit up. <laughs> nah, but I'm actually glad I, I had time to mess with it. Uh, it's just hard to work here at the shop on my free time because I get, I get in the mood and I get called to the front. But hey, we got to do what we got to do. We got to get this bad boy running. Get it up off this trailer. All right, pop that damn start on along with a whole bunch of other little wine starting to hook everything up Uh, gotta find I got a different type plug now gotta go get that Uh, missing a few other things the old pressure switch over there. I need a little thing. This is gonna be for my vacuum for my Brakes, I'm gonna have to move this. I done tested the air filter That's not a good spot for it but i'm gonna leave it to crank it up and then i'll move the, the filter but if you look back back behind there that egr valve plate man I, I need to make a little block off plate but i gotta pop this damn carburetor off completely so i can make one i tried to look for one i've bought them before but i can't even find one uh so i'll just make it real quick but it's got to come off it's coming together Whew, whole bunch of little shit just making sure everything connects and all that man i'll beautify it later I want to hear this uh, this baby uh, crank up and run. All right, so uh, how the fuck I'm going to make a template? Hmm. Let me uh, crack my head for a little bit. Hear me out though, right? So Jay Prince is, is again like mad. That is a reality. Hey, they can't tell me no, I'm going to squeeze them. That's Come on, what the fuck you need to do. Not the prettiest of fast jobs, but a quick little bla plate. Once it's painted and nice, you won't even notice it. I'm not gonna paint it right now. I'm just gonna try to slap everything back on. On to the next. Chipping away at it, chipping away at it. Put the little plug back there, that uh, oil pressure switch. I think what we got next is uh, spark plug wires. I got a battery right there. Obviously that bitch is humongous, but it's a good battery. Uh. Yeah, let me do spark plug wires. And then I need positive and uh cable for the uh battery, but I'ma just I could use the jumper cables. Man, you know what? I might have some starting fluid. Might be able to see if it'll crank. I actually got some nice Excel wires, but I don't have the thing to crimp the boots on them. So I'ma just uh got my firing order on the on the phone right quick. I'm going to use them. Them was actually brand new. I had used them on the box and only drove it like two, three times. 
like I said, I wasn't paint. I was trying to paint everything. Now I'm just slapping everything on. So I'll go back and clean it up. I just want to hear this motor run, man. Whew. All right, fellas, I got the uh, spark plug wires in. I got this battery. I, it was charged a while back. I don't know if it got juice. So I hooked up the jumper cables. I think I should be able to uh, go in there and crank it. I'm not sure. From my, I think I got everything hooked up. Now, I don't know if the distributor right. But I should be able to crank it. Hold on. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. There's people. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. Messing up the bub lights. Oh, do I even got the key in here? Oh, I see something dangling. Yeah. Oh, uh-oh. We got light in the dash. Uh-oh. What y'all think? Oh, it wants to. Oh shit! It's just, the the spinner. I mean, the starter is spinning, guys. I hear it. Uh oh. I mean, that's a good thing. Well, not a good thing. I think maybe the wrong starter. I don't know. Let me go underneath there. Well, guys, I guess the wine is good, but. Let me show you. I'm gonna do it real quick with the screwdriver. Uh, it just it just spinning. Y'all hear it? So either I got the wrong starter or I got the wrong flywheel. Uh, or that starter just fucked up from the get go. It's a brand new remanufactured. I got. I, I kind of have to have someone uh, crank it while I look at the Bendix. So, damn, that kind of ends our night. I was kind of wanting to see if it would crank. The battery does got juice. Uh, man. Well, we'll check it out tomorrow. Have my pops hit it for me. And I'll peep it, see what's, what I could peep. A ver, dale. <laughs> Y'all see that? Motherfucker, not even close. I got the flywheel. I guess the flywheel is is off or the starter's off. One of the two. Yeah. <sighs> All right. Let me figure it out. Ah, man, guys. Uh. <laughs> well, that totally blows. Hopefully, uh, I actually bought that starter new. They might have uh just gave me the wrong starter. I bought it like six months ago. That's the problem when, whenever you uh. Work on the car on and off, you don't even know. I don't even know if it's the original flywheel. I think it's the original flywheel, but remember we swapped motors. The motor in the box used to be in here. And I don't know, you know what I'm saying? So one, it could be a, a different starter. Or two, the flywheel. That's it, that's all it could be uh, before we could try to crank her back up. So right now I'm actually gonna go to the house. I, have, I should have the original starter somewhere. I'm gonna try to look for the original starter Hopefully that's it, because if not, we're going to have to take down the transmission so we can change that flywheel. Yeah, I went through uh, my container and found this is the original shard. I can't even talk. This is the original starter to this car. And it's exact same as the one we got in there right now. Oh my God. So the thing I'm going to try is, since I did take the motor and transmission out this car, I'm thinking it's original flywheel, probably... Uh, ended up in the box so i'm gonna go to the uh auto parts and then i'm gonna order uh a starter for a box chevy see if it's a little different before i take it's before i take down the transmission and mess with the flywheel okay so we got the box chevy starter in it is a little different it even bolts up to different holes i already looked it's still gonna bolt up to my block so let's peep it and see uh if this Bendix is a lot closer. Oh yeah, that looks like money. I might have to add a few shims, but that's definitely gonna spin that flywheel. That's what it was. It's probably the flywheel out the box. That's exactly what that was. Moment of truth. Wired her up. Dale. Nada? Ah, ya se murió la batería, pues. Dale otra vez? Nada, eh? Oh, okay. Está bien. A ver, a lo mejor son los cables, espere. Conectar 
ver, cállale. A ver, a ver. All right, I put another shim on it. Maybe thinking it'd be too close to the motor. Let's give it a try. Uh, let me check this charger. Déjeme prender esto. Ahí está dando vuelta. Oh. Eh, dale otra vez. Alright, so I found this cable. Ugly ass terminal. Bad ass terminal. <laughs> nah, that's just for right now. We was thinking we're not getting enough juice. That might be it. We're just leaving that for right now. I gotta let you know. I ain't trying to spend no money right now, man. I'm just trying to get this motherfucker on with shit that I find around here. Whew, we'll make it look pretty and, and matching and everything later, but make sure to get this motherfucker on. Alright, let's give it a second, uh, second try. Fucking what? 87th try. <laughs> I'd rather try to do it by the key so I can mess with the distributor and stuff, but let me see if this has got enough juice before I call my pops over here. What? Did I just burn that hole off? Hold on. Uh oh. That bitch ain't doing shit now. Uh oh. A ver, espérese. No mucho que. No, ya no le eché, pero le estoy moviendo acá el distribuidor. Pues ver, no está, no sabemos si está bien. A ver, dale como que quería. Está pesado. Pues a lo mejor estaba muy fuera de tiempo. A lo mejor no está exactamente el distribuidor sentido. Pues no, vamos a calar unas cuantas veces más. Ah, it looks like a uh, man. I'm probably gonna. Th I'm thinking the distributor wasn't stabbed in there, right? Uh, I didn't do that, so we're gonna uh, let me pull that out and then uh, put that number one piston up and see if it's lining up. Let me check that first, and then we're gonna go ahead and hook up the fuel. I got my hose hooked up to my manual fuel pump. I'm gonna just need a little gas tank up here. Oh, hey. I like it, I like it. I mean, you know, hey, that's how it goes. I'm glad uh, it's spinning and it wasn't locked up. I had this motor outside for a long time, so. All right, let me kick it, keep at it. All right, pop the cap off, pop that one spark plug out through the rag in there. Now we just need to spin it, do that old school uh, rag trick, pop it open and hopefully that hole's pointing this way. Ahí está. Ahí salió. Pero, oye, ok, sí, sí está apuntando derecho para enfrente casi. Solo saco y lo muevo para atrás. Take this information as you will, but sometimes when the distributor doesn't want to sit exactly where you want it. Let me see if I can get the light on there. Oh, there we go. It's not focusing. But y'all see, there's like a key down there. Uh, you got to line it up. There it goes. Let's see if it'll focus. There it goes. You see that? Just get you a flathead screwdriver and carefully turn it how you need to so that distributor uh, sit all the way down. That actually turns the oil pump. I got that hose sitting and it's pointing to uh, my number one piston. So uh, let's put everything back. Give it a try. Okay. I want them. Uh oh. All right, let me hook up the power, y'all. Looks like it's all right. Uh oh. All right, hooked up the plugs. Oh, hold on, give me a second. I got the gas tank hooked up too, so hopefully it'll pump up gas. Oh, it's already got a little bit of gas in the filter. All right, let's try Okay, aguanta. Uh oh. Wants to. Alright, aguanta. 
A ver, dale. Ya está muriendo la, la batería. Ok. Alright, I probably flooded it and battery's draining, so we're gonna charge the battery for a little bit and give it a second try. ¿Fue mucho? ¿O le muevo el desfibrador un poquito? ¿Para atrás? Muevele poquito. ¡Ay! Battery juiced up again. Last time we wanted to crank. My pop's gonna help us out. Be on the camera and crank action. Woo! Hopefully we get it cranked up a little bit. Okay. Hey, y'all chingo up. Shit, that's good enough for me. I mean, we gotta get it. I gotta get hook up radiator and everything, but damn. Honestly, man, I'm gonna end this video right there. Appreciate y'all watching. Catch me on the next one. Okay.